guys, what's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. It's Karina here and today we're going to be doing a massive try on for Boohoo. I actually have bought from Boohoo before like years ago and uh, I'm just curious to see like if anything has changed in the past few years. So I actually spent about $380 of my own money at Boohoo. They shipped here within two weeks or so. I think even though it was express shipping, it took two weeks to get to me. Um, so we're going to go through the clothes and see if it's worth $380. Okay, so first up we have this super cute ruffle dress that's like blue stripes and it's like spaghetti strap here, you know, it's like kind of like cute, like a really frilly summer dress. I thought it was a really cute design when I saw it on the site, but when I tried it on, it honestly didn't fit me very well. I mean, this is a US 4 or I think it's a small on their site. Um, but yeah, it's like not stretchy at all. So it's not flexible. And even the straps are not flexible, guys. Like this strap here is completely rigid. So yeah, if you buy this, you're just stuck with this one material. And um, it's a bit loose on me, as you can see here. I mean, it doesn't look too bad. So maybe if you're out for that like relaxed fit you know this one would be a great dress for you but i definitely think i'm gonna return this okay next up we have this super cute lavender dress when i first saw it on the website the model made it look so 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 good and i'm like oh my god i need that dress in my life so i bought it and it's actually super cute like i am so happy with how it turned out this one is a size six so i think it's an extra small and yeah, like there's no, um, I don't think there's any elastic to this either. There's a tiny bit of elastic right here at the front, just the front part of the chest area. Um, but I think it fits really beautifully on me. This is a true extra small. It has like a scrunched in waist around here and then it flows beautifully down. It has like a mermaid tail. Um, I think I'll be keeping this because this is so gorgeous to wear out to like a summer party or like any sort of like wedding season. It is great. Okay, next up uh, we have a super super fun lacy white dress. So this is, I don't think this is considered lace. This is like a meshy material with like big chunky holes in them. <laughs> oh yeah, I suck at describing things today. But yeah, this is what you see on here is basically what this is. I got it in the size small, so US 4. And yeah, it fit me really well. It's so funny because this one... It's the same size as this one. They're both a US 4, but this one is like super big on me. Do you think their sizing is a tiny bit inconsistent? Um, this one doesn't have any stretch to it either. It just features a zipper at the back, but I think I'm gonna keep it because it fits really well on me and I think it's cute. Okay, next up we have this fun pink gin dress, okay? You don't get to say, you know, you're in summer without having a pink gin dress in your closet. So this one I think is super cute. It has like ruffle details on here and at the chest area. The straps are, again, non-adjustable. What is with that? Can someone just put some elastic into their, their clothing so that it fits more people? Um, this one has like a really cute flirty like ruffle detail here near the chest area and um, you can tie it together using these two strings here so you can tie it tighter or you can tie it not as tight if you want depending on how much cleavage you want to show. So you can see in here that it's totally showing the clasp of my sticky bra under and I don't know about you but I don't really appreciate that. Um, maybe it's just me. Maybe it's just because I have really tiny boobs. And it's just showing for me. I don't know. If you have giant boobs, if you have, you know, bigger boobs than I do, then maybe this will not be an issue for you. But I'm just pointing it out because there are girls like me. Okay, okay, moving on with the Jinhem. Because I love Jinhem. Um, this is a little blue Jinhem two-piece that when I saw it, I was like, oh my god, I need it again in my wardrobe. And you know me, like, I don't really gravitate towards blue that much. So that says a lot about the style. I love this because this is just like a one-piece top that comes in just like one piece like that and it's up to you to tie it at the back however you want so that is something i really like and with something like this it's completely versatile and you can tie it however tight or however loose you want depending on how big of boobs you have bottom is so cute as well the bottom is just like a zipper up skirt um but it has like ruffles on the bottom it's not see-through it's pretty well made only one line but you know it's 
it's it is what it is for what you pay for this is the size 2 and um, this doesn't have an elastic to it either it's a surprise how all of this fit me without it having elastics next up with the two piece because your girl's crazy about two pieces these days you can just wear a top or the bottom just on its own it's so cute um, this one is a little cherry print two-piece set so this is um, I think this is like this is not cotton this is like a polyester fabric it's really thin it's really silky really smooth um, but I was curious to see whether it was see-through or not I wouldn't say it's a like completely opaque but I mean like you wouldn't be wearing like a black lacy bra under or something like that like you would be wearing like a nude colored bra with this but because the fabric is really um, smooth and silky it kind of works against you when you're trying to tie it at the front because it just keeps loosening <laughs> And my bra just keeps like popping out. This is like a wrap skirt that's white and it doesn't have an inner lining. So it's just like one fabric. Because um, usually, you know, with white you want to be more careful about the see-throughness and the quality. So yeah, I mean, it's still a pretty cute skirt by design. I just don't know if I would wear it out. Okay guys, the next outfit is my absolute favorite outfit of the entire haul, the entire bunch. I'm going to show you. This is a white cropped top with like kind of like frilly sleeves here and um, it features like these two elastic finally elastic um, strings that you can tie here at the top and the material is really good the material is not like one of those like see-through skirts at all like it's kind of like thick and it does have some kind of stretch to it so yeah this will definitely be like what I'm keeping and this skirt okay you guys I am in love with the skirt. Like, I love it so, so much. This is a pink, I want to say it's like a muted pink skirt that um, is kind of high-waisted. So it goes up to here, and it has a scalloped trim on the bottom, and I just think it's so cute and so romantic. And it has a tiny bit of a stretch, not too much. Again, it has a zipper up on the side or at the back, and it's just like the cutest thing to put on. Like, when I wear it, I'm just like, ugh. This is so cute. It's so cute. Like, you should get this for sure. You should get this combo. White and this. Like, it's the best combo ever. Like, just... It just... Okay, so the next outfit is this cute little lavender top that is elastic. Fairly elastic, you know, for what it is, you know, compared to the rest of the boohoo styles. Um, it's elastic at the top and elastic at the bottom here. And what you do is you just tie these two things together to form kind of like a bra over your bra and yeah the only thing about it is that it is quite short so it covers just your bra area but i do think it's like really cute like it has that kind of like retro vibe that's so in right now and if you go to the beach with it you just like wear a bikini under and have this over the top of your bikini that would be super cute so i paired it with uh jean shorts these are the boohoo blue jean shorts i think it's like another sub brand of boohoo so it's pretty high waisted it goes up to here and um the only thing about it is that i don't know if it's actually a us4 because it does feel really baggy and really loose on me and i typically fit a small anyway i think the style is cute i think it goes perfectly with this top i just wish they came in the smaller size okay guys so the next outfit i'm featuring this skirt mini skirt so this actually is in the size 2 so this is a US 2 extra small and it's still a little bit big on me as you can see in the in the video clip here so I mean there's no stretch to this this reminds me of the American apparel tennis skirts that were like all the rage a few years back and um, the only difference is that this one is in the checkered gray color um, what really attracted me was the picture on the site of course like the model made it look so gorgeous and I was like oh my god I need it um, and I picked it up and I'm kind of disappointed because I really wanted to love this I mean everything about this is perfect except for the sizing so the next outfit I'm keeping on the same top the top is not from Boohoo by the way the top is actually from Shein and um, if you saw my previous Shein 20 outfits video I featured the top in there it's one of my staple tops that I wear with literally everything so yeah, I'm pairing with this one. This one is a muted pink pleather shorts. So this entire thing is made of pleather. It's elastic banded. So, you know, it looks like this. This is in a size small. You can actually see 
the elastic band if you just like flip it on the inside. Um, I find it a bit weird because usually for shorts like this they would have another fabric inside or like a lining to cover up the band so you're not looking at the actual band but no here it is. For the price I guess it's a pretty good price and the fit is actually really great. So it fits right up your belly button. This is super high waisted style because it is paper bag style. You know it just cinches in your waist and make your legs look super super long and this would be the perfect style to go with like any crop tops that you own. Next up we have a really cute vinyl pink skirt. I have never owned any sort of clothing that is vinyl before in my life and this this would be my first one if you know if fit well but it actually didn't fit me that well and I was super disappointed because I really wanted to like it and I really wanted to keep this. It would be, you know, like the first piece of vinyl I own ever. And I just think the color is so gorgeous. Like the color is like this shiny little like nude pink color. It just reminds me of Barbie for some reason. And yeah, this is a US 4. I'm actually going to check if they have a US 2 because that might fit me better. Um, so as you can see on here, it doesn't really fit me well to my waist area. Um, but it's a little bit too tight for my bum. And I mean, like, I don't have a big bum, so I don't know how this would fit you or, it, you know, how it would fit, like, your regular girl that's a size small. But yeah, for me, it certainly didn't really fit my waist-to-butt ratio. Okay, so the next one is, again, one of my favorites. Not as favorite as the first pink skirt outfit, but this is definitely another favorite. This is a pinafore dress, which, you know, just has, like, these two straps over your shoulders, and the skirt actually starts here, so it's kind of like... An elastic waist skirt with two straps. I know somehow that makes it look so much like more retro and so much cuter. So I picked it up. It has like tiny, tiny houndstooth print, even though I don't think you can see it here. Um, it's there, I assure you, it's houndstooth. Whenever I have something like really cute like this, I always just go with a white t shirt under it because it's the simplest way to pair it and you can never go wrong with it. So yeah, I'm just pairing it with a white t shirt and it actually looks really cute. Like, I don't know what the type of style it's called, but I just really like it. This has elastic! Except keeping the same t-shirt from the last outfit, I have this um, striped skirt that is elastic again, yay! I should be just called like Elastic Girl because I love elastic so much. This has a paper bag waist again, so it sits up to here. And there's two ribbons that you can tie at the front or tie the back or tie the side or tie however you want. And I just think this material is so comfy. Like this is a, it's really soft and it's like one of those like premium -er cotton material. This one is a size four and it still fits me pretty well. So yeah, I say this one is a pretty good buy. Okay, moving on to something more casual because I know school is coming back up and I wanted to pick up some pieces that would be appropriate for school. So I chose this pair of jeans. It is the Boohoo Blue collection. Again, I think that's just their denim collection. And it's a size 2. So let's see how it fits on me. So it actually fits pretty well on me lengthwise. And you know, the knee rips and the knee slits are where it's supposed to be aka my knee um, and the length is pretty good I don't have to like roll it up or anything I'm 5'7 for reference all my measurements are down below so you can take you know a peek at it the only thing would be the waist I think the waist was a tiny bit loose on me this is a high rise fit which means it goes above your belly button and you guys know I'm all about that because it hides your food belly and it hides any kind of like I don't know like little tummy protrusions that you have I have it too so I'm especially excited to try this one out and it does come up to my belly button is but the only thing is that it doesn't really fit my waist um, maybe it's because I have a super tiny waist I don't know um, my the butt area fits me perfectly so yeah, it's something that you know you want to consider. Okay, next up we have a little maxi number. This is a tie-dye maxi skirt. Um, it has like pink and white and like blue streaks on it. And um, what really attracted me about the skirt was that it has like a waterfall like slit at the side. You know, I'm all about slits. So I kind of just like picked it up and wanted to see, you know, if it would go with any of my bikinis. 
So if you have like a vacation coming up, this would be perfect to layer over your bikinis or for just like regular summer outings, I think it's a good thing. Just be sure not to like hike up too high, otherwise the slit will just be like completely open. I mean, not a big deal if you're wearing a bikini bottom under. Okay, so back onto the denims. This is a denim jacket. It's a size eight. And yeah, this one has like rips on the shoulder, front detail on the elbow area. So, you know, I think it's cute when you're pairing it with like a summer dress or even when you're like back in school and you want to like have a denim jacket to throw on whenever it gets chilly. I think this can be a really good, um, just a staple to have in your wardrobe because denim jackets can literally like go with every single outfit. Okay, next up we have this super cute faded lavender crop top. So you guys know I'm all about ruffles this summer. This is kind of like a little romantic frilly crop top and I love that it is so stretchy and it has so much elasticity to it. And um, yeah, it just has like frills at the front and it comes down to here with more frills and the sleeves of course has more frills. So <laughs> yeah, it's just kind of like a cute little summer piece. Just pairing it with a regular white skirt. Okay, next up I want to talk about this white blazer. So, I wasn't too sure how the quality of the blazers were gonna be at Boohoo. So I picked one up and this is a white blazer with gold buttons down the side here. And it's a full length blazer. It comes down to your hips. And I just really like white blazers. I actually just wear it over like my crop tops and my skirts. And I think they just like really make an outfit pop and make it more like sophisticated if you know what I mean. You don't have to break your bank to get a quality blazer. This one is definitely affordable alternative. Um, the pockets are not real pockets so you know if you're really into pockets this one might not be for you but I think with you know the price that you're paying for it the buttons are just really good quality. It's double lined throughout and it's not see-through and it's not like paper thin and you get that like kind of like shoulder pad here. I don't know. I just think it's really cute and it's really good quality for the price. Okay guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this Boohoo try on haul. I know I did and I definitely found some keepers and some like really awesome items from my haul. But I think overall the pieces are generally super cute. And um, you know, with the exception of a few sizing differences, you might really need to check the size guide on the site before you make a purchase. I think the prices are great. You know, I'm in Canada and they shipped it to me within two weeks. Another good thing is that when you shop from Boohoo and when you get your package here in Canada, you don't actually have to pay any duties because Boohoo actually covers that. Like they guarantee that you won't be paying any customs or any duties on it. So I think that's really great. The return policy is 14 days, which I think it's pretty standard. But I mean, for like online shopping, you do want to give some leeway for like people to try it on and you know, determine which pieces they want to keep and which pieces don't fit them. If you guys like this haul, make sure to check out my other videos. I do hauls every single week for you guys. So make sure you subscribe to me and I love you all. Bye.